Hey guys, what's up? Lewin here at GarageBand and beyond. Welcome back. So today what I'm going to do is show you how to set up um, to record multiple tracks at a time while using GarageBand. And I'm going to be using this one right here, uh, this interface right here. This is the PreSonus AudioBox USB. Um, if you would like to know more about this, check out my video, actually the previous video to this one. Um, so anyway, so as you can see, this is a two channel interface. So I'm only going to be able to set up two channels uh, at a time. But you know, uh, GarageBand can actually record up to eight channels at one time, but you have to have an interface with eight inputs. So I'm going to show you how to do two, but if you have eight, it would be the same thing. Uh, so let's get right to the screenshot and I'll show you how to do that. All right, so here we are inside the GarageBand new project window. As you can see, I've already set it up. Uh, you know, I, I just selected that I'm going to be making a vocal track and it's given me these two tracks up here, um, as you can see in the upper left hand corner. So let's, uh, let's get right to it. Let's uh, go under preferences and let's make sure that we have the right thing selected for our input. Um, let me just zoom in here. So I have it set to audio box USB. I, you know, I'm having my um, output come out through my computer just the way I do it. And uh, let's close this. Now, track one, I'm gonna come down here. Let's zoom in again to the input source. So you can see it right now it's set up to mono one audio box it's actually it will be defaulted as this um, as the stereo one slash two um, but i'm going to make it channel one and then we go up to the second track and as you can see i've already done it but let me just show you back to input source and mono two um, so now as you can see so let me tap on one microphone Right, so this is channel two. And then you also want to make sure that the tracks are armed. And there, I can track them both. Now if I tap on this microphone, I get signal into channel one. That's signal into channel two. So there you go, you can see I've got channels one and two are both uh, registering a track. And I can just sort of do this just so you can see that it actually does record it. Um, but that's pretty much it. So then, you know, it's up to you. Pan it however you want, whatever you need to do. But that's it. Uh, setting up multi-tracks on GarageBand is, couldn't be more simple, really. Um, and again, you can do up to eight tracks at a time, and you have to have a device that will do that. Um, but yeah, that's it. I hope you got lots of good information. Talk to you soon. Bye.